This is Suzanne in France, property reference SIF001418. Just new onto the market. It's a detached, spacious, detached family house. Built of stone. And you've just seen the solar panels on the roof. There's a beautiful kitchen extension at the end there, which opens out onto a decking area. Inside to a living room. Good sized room. We've got electric heating as well as the wood burner in this room. Nice and bright. You can really bring the ins outside in with huge bifold doors at the front. Again, another quick look round. And now into the kitchen dining room. And as you can see, it opens straight out onto the decking area. Large dining area. With an island. This was the extension. So this is the most recent part of the house. Solid wood worktops. And a huge array of matching base and wall units, including display units. That's the decking area. Ideally placed straight outside this room. So a choice of inside or outside eating areas. built-in oven and hob and a huge bank of units including a built-in coffee maker two ovens and a utility room small utility room leading straight off with a double sink unit and plumbing and space for your washing machine and a dryer and a downstairs loo Back out for a last look at the kitchen and dining area with deck. This is a study area. This gives you the stairs to the first floor. A study area, no desk in it at the moment, but obviously there's plenty of space to put one in. All new carpeting. And that's the window to the front. And into a lovely, bright downstairs bedroom. Up a couple of steps to get in. And it has a little dressing area here with hanging space. And straight into the ensuite shower room with a corner shower, a heated towel rail, and a vanity unit. And there was a toilet just around the corner. Now we're upstairs on the first floor landing. Nice spacious landing. Through to the side for guests. This leads you into the guest bedroom, one of the guest bedrooms. Again, newly laid carpet, nice spacious light room. Plenty of room for a large double bed. 
it goes back out onto the landing. Window out the front looking over the garden. And then you have a door to what could be an ensuite bathroom. It was planned to be, it isn't at the moment, uh, but the plumbing is in place. So the new owner can put their own stamp on that and choose their own furnishings. This is the currently the master bedroom suite. It's the other side of the landing. Again, big light space. With doors off leading to an ensuite bathroom, sorry, shower room. Double shower with the overhead rain shower, toilet. I've got a bath in here as well, and vanity unit. And onto the outside, you can see the gardens. This is walking up the drive towards the house. Kitchen extension on your left there with the weatherboarding. And we went to the property before the gardener had been in. He was due in the next day for a good cut back and tidy. Lots of mature trees and shrubs. And in total there's over an acre and a quarter here. So a little paddock, which isn't on film. This area leads through to a small pond, orchard and a chalet. Again, all due for a, a cut back, but you can see how pretty it is with the planting. If you'd like to know any more about details about this property, please go onto the website and look at the details there.